Podcast. Welcome back to the Booze Life. It's Jew. Christina is behind the camera because we heard the the comments, the reviews, and you guys wanted to see more of me. Um, and today we are at Dambo's Barbecue Shack in Pantigo, Texas, and we are going to be trying out their barbecue. So, uh, yeah, let's get into it. Put it up. Yeah. Hey guys, so we're at Jambo's Barbecue Shack uh, here in Pantigo, Texas. Let's see what they're all about. Hi, welcome to Jambo's. What can I give you guys today? Uh, we'd like to try the uh, Jambo, Texas. Absolutely, that is actually one of our stores. Yeah, we're going to try the Yes, couple of Alright. Yes, it is. I actually ate a portion of it every day. What did you guys open for? We've been for a couple of years since it's an actual location. It used to be down on the road. Okay. And came up here and we're trying to just make the best of everything. And Ashley is the owner? She is the owner. And you're her right hand? Kind of. Okay, this is her right hand. MIT. <laughs> and I've been with the company for almost two months in a row. This is truly a family atmosphere. Yeah, I can tell from everybody that's here that they don't really enjoy the idea. Absolutely. Question on that. Do you like the blue moon with Yes, I do. How about you throw those two on here? Yeah, sounds great. All right. And a blue moon. Yes. Oh, that'd be nice. Okay, perfection. I will get this up. And we'll have it out here table shortly. Thank you, Ms. April. You're welcome. Uh, see how that beef was on there? Has chopped beef, sliced beef, bologna, uh, ribs. Uh, and sausage all on one sandwich. So I'm excited. Frosted mud wow. and a whole lot of layered meaty goodness. And if there's anything else to ask me, please give us a hug. Thank you. Thank you. Jesus Christ! My parents are doing this thing. Got a frosty bug, blue moon. They have like this corn. They call it cowboy corn. Should I take the ribs off? We'll bite into it. It's like pepper, so you like brown sugar. It's amazing. This might be the best. Ribs, I've had it. No, Falls right off. This is amazing. So, I've had it So, first bite. Oh. 
Isso mesmo. Já se deve ficar com drogas. Let me, let me try this one. Got a little piece of it. Oh my God. It's perfect. I like sweet barbecue sauce. Best hands down. Yeah, I'm definitely going to stop and get some tones after this. All right, so we're back with Miss April. Thank you for having us. We are glad to have you guys. So good. Oh my God, I recommend this 10 out of 10. Can you just tell them a little bit about the hours of operation? Not a problem. Um, our hours of operation are actually from 11 o'clock to 8. We're doing that Sunday through Thursday nights. Fridays, we're going to be open from 11 a.m. until 10 p.m. We're going to be having live music, some artists come in. So, you know, come on down, have fun. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed um, this eating experience. Um, shout out to Miss April, she was amazing. Um, after we kind of cut, you know, she kind of let us in on what type of environment that Jambos is. Um, she called it the land of second chances. And it's one of those things that like certain people come into your life for a particular, like, particular reason. Like you meet people for a reason. Um, when we first walked in, we were kind of, you know... I don't want to say apprehensive, but we were kind of like, we didn't know what the vibe was going to be exactly. Uh, but Miss April, she came, she welcomed us in. She made us feel just at home. Um, she served all the food with a smile. And that's the type of people I feel like you want running your business or being the face of your business. Uh, for somebody to say that they love what they do and be willing to work seven days a week if they could is major. I feel like any business owner, any uh, entrepreneur would want that for themselves. Um, she says she's brought uh, family recipes to the restaurant and asked if the owner of uh, Jambos has taken up her on, on, the, uh, on the recipes. Like, that's amazing. You know what I mean? Like, it doesn't get too much better than that. And when we were leaving... Um, we were kind of, you know, just talking and catching up. Not really catching up. I felt like we'd known her forever almost. It was, it was weird. But it was like a her just kind of like showing us why Jambos is so important to her. Uh, a lot of people that know me know that I have like tattoos. And uh, my favorite tattoo is about my favorite Bible verse. It's Matthew 5, 9. Um, and it's, blessed are the peacemakers for they will be called the children of God. Um when we were leaving, she quoted more of the beautitudes, is what they're called in the Bible. Uh, it says, blessed are the cracked because they will show you the light. And it was kind of like, damn, like we're supposed to, we were supposed to meet this person. Uh, but yeah, so try out the Jambo Texan. I couldn't finish it. 
I don't know a person on the planet that really could. Um, they gave me a, a cold, cold beer. It was just an amazing environment, you know. Um, and I know you guys said you wanted to see more of me being myself. Uh, so there's no like Marilyn Monroe behind me, like you guys normally see with uh, Christina. Um, but yeah, you know, stay tuned. Uh, we're gonna have a lot more videos coming out um, to where we're able to kind of just show you guys what a day in the life is for me, Christina, family, friends, while we're planning a wedding. Um, yeah, so uh, peace. Thank you.